How to create a value scale for drawing. Take a strip of paper. I have used a approximately a 2 inch by 12 inch piece. I've taped it down and I am from the left hand side marking 1 inch increments on the top and bottom. Then lightly connect the top and bottom marks right across and you should end up with 11 spaces 10 of them will be one inch wide and then you will have a larger one at the end. Leaving the first square white, you'll move to the 10th square. It will be your darkest. So use an 8B pencil to shade it in. If you hold the pencil back a little bit and from the side, you can get a nice even pressure this square will be your darkest, so go back and forth in both directions just to fill in the white, applying the same even pressure throughout. Now using a 7B pencil, you can do the square right next to the last square you filled in. Again, holding the pencil in the same way and applying equal pressure that you applied to the first square. Now using a 2H pencil, you will be moving to the second square from the left and shading that in in the exact same way you did the previous squares. A 2H pencil is a much harder lead, so it will automatically be much lighter. For your next square, you will use an H pencil. Each pencil will get slightly softer as you go along, which is why the squares will automatically go darker with the same pressure point. From there, we will move to an F pencil and shade as we have before. Then we will use an HB pencil in the next square. As you'll notice, each square is getting slightly darker as you move along. Your next pencil will be a 2B. Then you will move on to a 4B. And finally, a 6B. Once you have finished shading this square, look at all your squares and check that you have about a 10% darker shade for each square. You may now remove the tape. Now take a hole punch and punch it near the top of each of the 10 squares. This will allow you to compare the shades to your drawing. Please be sure to hit the subscribe button if you would like to see more of my videos. Be sure to ring the bell if you'd like to get notifications when I post new videos. Thank you for watching.